www.rochellearthurst.com. So today I'm going to quickly show you how you can import a logic project into an existing logic project. So I work with a producer that helps me with adding sometimes some bass or other sounds to my music. So I tend to sometimes either send in my vocals with a skeleton track and he builds on it for me, or I sometimes even just can send him uh, a plain idea, vocal idea, and he can build something around it for me and help me build on my track. But in this instance, I'm gonna show you um, how easy it is to import your vocals that you may have recorded into the music that a producer might have sent you as a logic project. So this is a project that he sent me. It's got the music on it, as you can see here. I'll just play a bit of it for you. And then what I want to do now is add my vocals that I've already mixed into this track. Go to File, Import, and then Logic Projects. Then open up the project that you want to import by selecting it and pressing Import here. And then what you want to do is, first of all, if you go to Import Project Settings, you can select what you want to import into this uh, existing logic project. So just select all the things that you want to import. Um, as you can see, I've got most of mine turned on to be fair. Um, and then you press import. And then if you go here, you can either just select everything and just fling it into this project. So I'm just going to do that in this instance, just to make it a bit easier. Or you can just select whatever, uh, tracks you want to import. So if I'm just pressing shift and a downward arrow, and if I select one of these boxes, it will highlight everything here like this. And then I'm going to select add. And it's gonna ask me about the tempo settings. I'm going to say yes, because I want the tempo settings to match my existing project. And my producer would have done the beat around my vocals to fit. So select import. And now you can see that all of my vocals have been added to this track. And now to just check the timing, what I can do is if I just take it to the beginning of the song, uh, for example, I can see if it's all in time. So I won't play the entire track because this is a song that's actually going to be released soon. So um, yes, so that is how easy it is to import a Logic project into an existing Logic project. If you have any questions, please leave a comment below and I hope you find this tutorial helpful. Have a good day. www rochellearthers.com